Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News. Now it's six less than a week before eligibility expands to more people. Health officials and community leaders are trying to bridge the COVID vaccine disparity in our area. Renovated and ready to welcome back visitors. One area near Lake Elsinore prepares to show up some major upgrades. And yet another L.A. County facility is preparing to welcome migrant children from the U.S.-Mexico border. Hello, I'm David Ona. And I'm Ellen Leva. You're watching Eyewitness News at 6 Live on ABC7, Hulu Live, or wherever you stream. L.A. County expects a dip in vaccine supply next week as eligibility expands to get the shots. Meanwhile, underserved communities continue to lag when it comes to getting the vaccines. And I would assume for Tori Rand joins us live now with very latest on having to get as many people vaccinated and as quickly as possible. Jory? Yeah, David and Ellen, here's where we stand right now in the middle of April. When things are broken down by race, vaccination, Asians are leading the way with 40% of the LA County population, 16 and over, has already received at least one shot. If you look at whites, it's about 37%, but blacks and Latinos are still hovering down less than 23%. That disparity is something LA County is looking to change starting right now.